Hey guys, it's Rian here. And today I got a short five to 10 minute warm up routine for you. Uh, these are warm ups that I do myself on a daily basis before every practice. And feel free to add any of your own exercises before, during, or after. I'll leave that up to you. But I can't stress just how important it is to get a good warm up before every practice for the sake of injury prevention, but also just to get the highest quality out of your practice. Lots of times I have students coming out, they're dragging their feet, and that continues for the, for the rest of the practice. But as soon as I make them do a warm up, it's the highest quality that I can get from them. So today I got about five or six exercises for you guys, and I really hope you get the most of what I'm showing you. All right, so we're gonna start with some line to net jogs. From the baseline to the net and back is one set. And I recommend about six of these. Try to stay on your toes as much as you can. And really that applies for all these exercises. The more you can stay on your toes for tennis, the faster your movement. You're going to come off the ground a lot faster. Then we're going to go into some side shuffles. And really try to stay on your toes on this, but also try to keep those uh, shoulders square. And stay sideways as much as you can. This will help get out those groin muscles working. And this is a key warm up just because Tennis is so much lateral movement. And then we're going to go into some tango crossovers. What I'm trying to accomplish with this is to get as much shoulder rotation as I can. Because that will really help warm up the lower back as well as those hip muscles. And if you get enough uh, arm swing and arm rotation, you're going to warm up that upper back as well. Lots of the tennis strokes do involve a lot of rotation. So this is also another key warm up. Then we're gonna go into some lunges, which is great for warming up those quad muscles and that balance. What ends up happening, if you don't warm up your quad muscles enough, a lot of the times you end up reaching for your shots which ends up, which means that you sacrifice form and quality of your ball. And we're going to go into some high knees. This is great for getting some explosiveness going. And just to make sure that you start your practice with a lot more oomph. Following that, we're going to go into some line footwork warm-ups and this is great for warming up those toes and getting those feet going this also warms up your quads a lot so if you guys do this you'll feel it in your quads but that's great just for coming out with your feet on fire then we have torso rotations which is really to warm up that lower back and the upper back even the hips make sure you do this slow enough just so you don't hurt yourself And lastly, we're going to go into line to line jumps. Try to stick the landing on each jump. This is great for coordination as well as your balance. If you guys enjoy this footage, please leave a like, subscribe, and I can put up more content like this in the future.